So I'm just going to take a look at some of the cans to see if anything happened at this point. A lot of people have commented and told us what they think is going to happen. We appreciate you commenting, liking our page, letting us know. Doesn't look like much has happened with any of these at this point. The Coke can, the hairspray, or anything like that. Let's take a look. The Pam cooking spray hasn't done anything. The Pepsi, you can't even tell this on the camera. There's a little dent here on the side. I doubt you can see it, but that may be as the volume is starting to contract a little bit. A couple of people guessed the bush light. You can start to see a couple indentions on the bottom. Not a whole lot with this one either. And the Red Bull, not a whole lot's happened. So I have this trusty little handy dandy tool that allows me to test the temperature of each of these cans. So I'm going to see that, try to get it here on the Coke. So the Coke is currently registering at negative 33 degrees. Let's try the hairspray. The hairspray is coming in at minus 44. So the hairspray is colder than the Coca-Cola. All right, let's try the Pam about minus 42 so these two are close maybe the type of can that they're in let's try the pepsi the pepsi is very similar to the coke we're looking at minus 31 so right now pepsi is the winner as far as the warmest goes bush light oh we've got even a bigger winner on the warmest still the bush light is at minus 28 degrees so bush light is the warmest and then i'll test the red bull here it is also at about 33, minus 33. So obviously we mentioned that the hairspray and the Pam are a little bit colder. No explosions yet, no contracting really of the cans other than a little bit on the bottom of the Pepsi and the Bush Light. So we're still gonna let this go for a little while, check out, see what happens. I'm gonna try something here. I'm gonna try to take the lid off of the hairspray and see if this makes a difference. I'm gonna take the lid off of the cooking spray as well. And again, we'll see if anything happens. Stay tuned, thanks for watching. Keep commenting and letting us know your thoughts and we will continue to keep you updated on what's going on. I'm gonna check it about every hour as we go through the afternoon and stay warm. It's about 11 degrees below zero here in Des Moines and the wind chill is still near 30 below. So I'm gonna head inside, I've been out here long enough. Thank you.